Deep brain stimulation is a surgical technique. It's a procedure. What we do is we implant electrodes or wires in the brain in very specific areas and we use those wires to deliver a very fine electrical current to those regions of the brain in order to reduce the symptoms and the signs of Parkinson's disease and other movement disorders. The electrodes in the brain are connected up to a battery which is implanted under the skin just below the collarbone in most cases. That battery allows us to deliver a continuous small electrical current to the brain in a very controlled fashion in order to reduce the symptoms and signs of Parkinson's disease or other movement disorders. Despite the fact that it's called deep brain stimulation, in most cases we're not actually stimulating the brain, we're shutting down areas of the brain. By delivering uh, an electrical current, which is a fairly high frequency current, the nerve cells in the area of the electrode stop working. And that allows us to fairly reliably and accurately shut down a small volume of brain around a particular part of the electrode. So even though we're delivering an electrical current, we're actually inhibiting the brain or shutting it down rather than stimulating it. Parts of the brain that we're delivering an electrical current to are thought to be participating in the circuitry that's involved in Parkinson's disease. And so what we're effectively trying to do is disrupt that process. By affecting what goes on in one part of the brain, we can influence the pattern of activity in various other parts of the brain, and that can have a positive benefit on their underlying condition.